I went to live in East Jerusalem at the beginning of 2008. I stayed there for approximately five years, during which time I made a number of art and photographic projects in the West Bank. I decided to make work about Jewish settlers for a number of interlocking reasons. One was they are kind of vilified both in the West as settling on the Palestinian land, which is illegal, they, these settlements are illegal, because I come from a, a Jewish background and they are very insular. I was able to kind of infiltrate and work with these people over a, num a number of years. Uh, they're also very disliked amongst mainstream Israeli society and of course disliked in, in the greater world at large. They're, they really kind of feel themselves that they're extremely isolated and I wanted to know things, most of them are new immigrants to Israel, why they had decided to put themselves in this situation. I, I wanted to do is I wanted to try and demystify the settler kind of community. They are people living in these towns and villages that are often extremely isolated from the world, and isolated from Israel. But they ultimately, most of them are Western educated people and they know that in the eyes of the world that you know, what they are doing is wrong, that they are living on disputed land. But I wanted to see if people could actually justify that in any way and the only justification that they can come up with is that God gave us this land and it's our right to be here which is fucked up and stupid. And one of the things that's come up is the book of this work, the settlement book, is very popular in Arab countries and in Arab universities. This is the first time that they've been able to kind of see it laid out in a very, very simple way like this, rather than kind of in a reactionary photojournalistic way or in kind of news stories. So that's very pleasing.